good morning students welcome to masya sevasram inter college online classes in the previous class we saw the lesson number 2 tsunami and uh, it hit in andaman nicobar island and tamil nadu sea coast now island means a piece of land surrounded by water okay now in the previous day we saw that two persons stories one is ignatius and other one is of sanjeevs now today we will see the other part of the lesson 13 year old magna was swept away along with her parents and 77 other people okay 13 year old magna was swept away along with her parents so magna is a girl's name she and her parents along with 70 other people were washed away with the water she spent two days floating in the sea holding on to a wooden door so two days magna was in the sea okay now how she was uh, in the uh, sea she was holding on to a wooden door ओके दरवाजा लकड़ी से बनाया वाला दरवाजे में पकड़ के वो तीन दो दिन समुद्र में रहा शी स्पेंड टू डेज फ्लोटिंग इन द सी होल्डिंग ऑन टू अ वुडन डोर इलेवन टाइम्स शी सो रिलीफ हेलीकॉप्टर्स ओवर हेड बट दे डिड नॉट सी हर सी नाउ एज शी वॉज फ्लोटिंग इन द सी शी सो द हेलीकॉप्टर ओवर हेड हेड 11 times okay but the helicopter people did not see our uh, magna she was brought to the shore by a wave and was found walking on the sea shore in a days so with one wave she came to the sea shore to the land okay and then she was walking in a days days means confusion पता नहीं ना वेर आया ओके आई एम सिंपली वॉकिंग हियर एंड देर इन कंफ्यूशन डेज मीन कंफ्यूशन डी ए इजेड इ डेज मीन कंफ्यूशन सो दिस इज द थर्ड पर्सन ओके मैग्ना आलमा जावेद वॉज टेन इयर्स ओल्ड ना अनदर पर्सन स्टोरी ओके आलमा जावेद वॉज टेन इयर्स ओल्ड सो दिस गेल इज ऑफ टेन इयर्स ओल्ड She was a student of Carmel Convent in Port Blair where her father and father had a petrol pump. Now this uh, Alma Almas is a student who was studying in Carmel Convent in Port Blair where her father had a petrol pump. Her father had a petrol pump. Her mother Rahila's home was in Nankori Island so her mother was living in Nankori Island the family had gone there to celebrate christmas now alma's family had parivar nankori mein gaye the kya kele to celebrate christmas when the tremors came early in the morning the family was sleeping so when they felt that tremor tremor means i told in the previous class it is a shaking of the earth due to the earthquake alma's father saw the sea water recede so alma's father saw the sea recede sea water recede recede means going back the sea is going back going moving backward he understood that the water would come rushing back with great force so now alma's father understood that the sea that is moved backward will come forward with a great force and that will be the tsunami okay he wo- aw- woke everyone up and tried to rush them to a safer place so now he made everyone to get up because they were sleeping he made everyone to get up and uh, went out of the house to a safer प्लेस कुछ सुरक्षा सुरक्षित जगह पे उन लोग गए एज दे रैन हर ग्रैंड फादर वॉज हिट ऑन द हेड बाई समिंग एंड ही फेल डाउन सो एज दे वर रनिंग आउट ऑफ द हाउस 
her grandfather was hit by something on his head and he fell down her father rushed to help him so uh, um, this girl's father went to save the grandfather who had fallen then came the first giant wave that swept both of them away now what happened another wave okay wave means lahar okay that came and that wave took away their father and the grandfather so both of them were washed away with the water alma's mother and aunts stood clinging to the leaves of a coconut tree calling out to her now alma's mother and aunts okay they were holding on to coconut trees leaves and they were trying to save themselves okay and they were calling out for almas a wave uprooted the tree now what happened this wave uprooted mean ukkar diya okay even the nariyal ka ped ko ukkar diya and they two were washed away so now almas mother and her aunts were also washed away with the water almas saw a log of wood floating so now alma saw uh, a um, piece of wood was floating in the sea uh, lo- log means lakdi ka ek tukda she climbed on to it so what did alma do she climbed on the that log of wood log of uh, wood then she fainted uske baad kya ho gaya usko wo behosh ho gaya when she woke up she saw in a hospital in kamota so when she came to her consciousness where she was she was in a hospital uh, the place is kamota from there she was brought to port blair so from the hospital she was brought back again to port blair the little girl does not want to talk about the incident with anyone now that girl did not want to talk about this incident ye ghatna ke bare mein kisi se share karne ke liye wo nahi chahte hain she is still traumatized why she is not uh, wanting to share that incident with others because she was traumatized traumatized means see she was shocked shocked with that event and fear she had a fear you know the all of the family all the family members were dead and gone in that tsunami okay so that is really a shocking news for her and a fear okay because of that she doesn't want to remember and recall that incident that's why she did not want to share that incident with others so with that we finished our first part of the lesson now read this part of the lesson and understand and learn the word spellings and the meaning okay rest of the lesson we will continue next in the pre- in the next class okay so till then thank you and good day